morning. It's the next day and I slept so good. Like it was it was amazing to sleep here in this double room. Like this is I don't know, this felt like luxury. Um this alberg was amazing. For a municipal beyond all expectations. Um yeah. I'm actually packed almost everything. The only thing is my feet. I have to um yeah, I have to use plaster and tape them. They are definitely a bit sore, so I can show you in a minute how they look like now. Um yeah. We'll see how we do. Um today I'm only walking to Santo Domingo, which is like 15 kilometers, so I definitely do a shorter day today and um yeah, it's like 6.30 now. Um, I'm not the last one so far. <laughs> and uh, I will also do a little bit stretching out before I leave. So, yeah. So with that, we are really ready. Mm. Let me show you my feet. Um, if you can't see any kind of like blister stuff, hop over for 30 seconds. <laughs> so here's the current situation. You can see the blister is like dry from the inside. Um, because we drained it but then now it started out to get a bit sore here and I definitely can feel that um, we got like an antiseptic from the pharmacy and I'll put on um, this cream on top of it and then I'll have like these plaster and then taping it with that so <sighs> So as you can see, we're walking um, towards very dark clouds. Yeah, if it's gonna rain, I'm not sure about that. Yesterday it rained a bit when we were walking, but it was really nice. Like it was like a sun-kissed rain. Um, yeah, that was amazing. <laughs> it didn't bother me at all. But I have to say, they look a little bit more serious. So I think if it's raining, it will rain more. So we'll see how that goes. And this morning I walked with Lindsay and Sarah again. And then I stopped to eat my breakfast and they continued. So I might see them in the next town. But I have to say like my blisters, like they're not blisters anymore, but they're obviously wounds and yeah, they hurt walking. I definitely happy that I don't walk more than 15 kilometers today. Um, yeah. And then in Santo Domingo, I actually would like to get, yeah, I need to buy a new shampoo. And I wanted to send some postcards. That's kind of like the plans for today. And I think I have like 10 kilometers left. So we will be there in no time. <laughs> and hopefully dry. <laughs> I completely forgot to um, vlog yesterday 
it was a really tough stage my feet hurt because of the blisters oh, this is loud <laughs> we're here next to the the highway no it's not the highway no, but next to the road and yeah like my drained blisters really hurt walking um it felt like i had to walk like on my toes like a ballerina <laughs> and that was really tough and then we ended in Santo Domingo de la Calzada like planned but I was already kind of like a bit grumpy and the albergue was really nice I didn't film anything but it was the albergue de Peregrinos and they all you can see they're kind of like made for I don't know, like I think 200 pilgrims, but they put us in like eight different rooms and only on the lower bed. So that was really nice. And it was so cool because you got like a receipt and the receipt was in the language that was in your passport, like, or like the nationality that your passport had. I, I thought that was so cool. <laughs> yeah. And then I ate lunch with Liam and Ray and I was just so grumpy so and the, the spaghetti carbonara that I ordered was just awful it didn't taste good at all I ate just a little bit so Liam and Ray ate a little bit more of it but yeah I didn't really like it yeah and then I planned to just kind of chill a bit and then in the end I watched like three hours of reels on Instagram instead of doing anything else like more productive things <laughs> it's not the problem that I'm watching reels but I definitely see that I use it to dissociate from feeling a bit low feeling a bit lonely um, I mean everyone who I walked with the past days have been kind of continuing to Gagnon um, yeah and I felt a bit left behind and I mean that's also part of the Camino you have to walk your own you can't rush things or well, you can take the bus and then jump over places or stages but you really shouldn't um, follow somebody just to be with them but then but going your own Camino in your own pace but at one point I got out of bed took a shower, went to the supermarket, bought like a bagel with cream cheese, salmon and avocado. And that's actually my breakfast and lunch also for today. Oh, and even got a kombucha with like um, strawberry taste. Mm, it was really good. So yeah, it ended on a positive note, but I didn't film anything, sorry for that. And um, yeah, I see you very soon. <laughs>